Hello everybody, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron Force of Fingers France. And uh, I'm going to show you how I beat Germany super early. Just not knock them out before they even get off the ground. It's uh, it's fairly simple. It's uh, not something most people do. But uh, it, it, again, it's incredibly easy to do yourself if you needed to. Um, and all you need is these three little armies here. Um, basically, the the plan, you want to stick a little fallback line here, because uh, that will come into play in a little bit. Uh, stick the rest of your boys on the uh, the army there, not you mate, you guys come sit there. Uh, sort out your generals and stuff, and then just wait for the in-game event that uh, lets Germany... Uh, well, let's you declare war on Germany, sorry. Uh, for generals, you want ones with high defense. I'll show you why in a second. Um, apart from this guy, you're going to want the five attack for him, simply because he's going to need to push up here. But yeah, we're going to show you just how to defeat Germany, basically, in 1936. Once you've got all your generals and stuff sorted, build yourself a little Maginot line. Just a little one. Not there, maybe not there. But just a little Maginot line behind the uh, the original one. Uh, because the way you're going to defeat Germany is by draining them. And they are not going to attack uh, level 10 forts. They're not. They don't push through the Maginot. They've got better AI than that. They're not going to do it. Um, you don't have to worry about colonies because you're not at war with Italy. Because Italy aren't in the Axis yet. Um, but you are going to have to worry about a little civil war that starts, and it always starts in Calais. Every time I've seen it, it starts in Calais. So just stick your boys here, get them ready for a war in Calais. That's where you want the attack dude, so he's going to mop up the, uh, the lads here. Uh, actually bring over one of the defense boys as well. Who's got the lowest defense? Uh, you've got the best attack as well. Bring over one of the defense boys. Because again, like, it doesn't matter what you do, the Germans aren't going to attack this line whatsoever. And here it is! Uh, once they remilitarize the Rhineland, just say it's an act of war. That's all you gotta do. Just be like, do you know what? Fuck you, Germany. You're trying to declare war on us, you sons of bitches. That's terrible. Why would you do that? Yeah, the Germans must be dealt with. And there they are. Oh, he's gone. Well, that's fine. There's the commies. Get on their border before they can. And uh, just hold, really. They're going to push. You just want to hold. That's all you want to do, is just hold. The Germans aren't going to push. You've got level 10 forts. They're not going to touch them. But these lads, on the other hand, get a bit rambunctious. Just kill them. Once you've finished uh, finally murdering all the communists, uh, just finish them off if they're in their little home. They should capitulate by now, but for some reason they're not. Just finish them off, and then you're going to want to stick your boys on your little Maginot line, your little backup Maginot line you made, uh, because that's going to come in handy, because the Germans aren't going to, as you can see, the Germans aren't attacking. They're not attacking them, but you are going to want them to sit on the Maginot line, and you to just drain them of manpower, because level 10 forts don't matter when you've got no boys to sit on them. Oh, look how under-equipped the Germans are now. They're just throwing themselves at our lines, it's incredible. Just watching them absolutely massacre themselves as they slam against my fucking uh, front line. I've made a huge navy for the shits and giggles. I, I don't really like the navy. I, I don't know how it works. Just stuck them all in one big cursed pile. I know that's not how the navy's meant to go, but fuck it. It's my navy. Right, let's get some marines so we can do some naval invasions. Oh, the Germans have stopped. Look at that. They finally stopped. That gives our boys a chance to dig in. Oh, the war is going so well. Look at them just slowly oh, beating on us. It's going oh, magnificently. We might have to use a bit of the old uh, reorganising the boys here, but that's fine. You know, I, I spent like most of the time just moving lads around. Hey, we can get the Soviet Union in our war. Oh, Germany are fucked. Well, Italy's joined the war. We've got our nice little southern garrison defending us, so we should be okay to be fair. Shouldn't be in too much of an issue. Uh, okay, we'll push. Really, we're just sitting here wasting a bunch of German lives. They've lost, like, I think, a million dudes? They've lost almost one and a half million dudes compared to what was that? 400? Compared to our 420k. 
Like, we are kicking their ass. Luckily, we finally started making a decent amount of guns. And we're actually getting manpower, because we're on surface by requirement. Uh, we're just kind of sitting here now, and just draining them ever so slowly. Alright, we got our naval invasion off. I don't think there's that many troops. Apart from Italians, maybe. But uh, the thing with allies is they don't guard your ports for you. So, like... The Italians aren't guarding German ports, it's just German troops, and I don't think... Why are you guys not... Hey. Come, like... Assist. Come assist these boys. Are you not gonna, like, attack with them? No? Okay. Um... I think it's just Germans here, so... Hopefully these guys, even though they're not marines, can punch through and kick them off. Oh, and we're at war with Finland now. Or at least the uh, the Russians are. Which is fun. We landed. The best part is the Germans haven't even been able to do Anschluss yet. Because they don't have the manpower in the field. Oh yeah. We're out. That's going to pull a bunch of uh, Germans away from the front. So that these boys can uh, push out. And once they push out, they, uh, they can run free. That's beautiful, boys. Where are the Russians? Are they coming? Russia, where's your troops? Get them over here. Carefully push. Carefully push. I don't want to lose anybody. The Germans are getting bullied by the Netherlands. That's something you don't always see. They have no troops, that's why. They've got, like, they haven't even been able to do Angelus yet, because they don't have enough troops. Um, I'm going to do something that uh, I like to call Run for the Capital. Uh, basically, I have here... I can't afford trucks in my current economy. Uh, but I have here... 24 horse divisions. All green, because I can't be able to train them, because this is just an experiment that I am doing. Who the fuck... Lord Edward Halifax. I have never seen him. What? St he, they don't study as she goes. Oh, I've never seen this guy. Oh, Soviets have declared war on Poland. Please don't join a faction. Please don't join a faction. Oh, what are you doing, the Soviet? You're losing. Ah, oh, fuck it. Who cares? Ah, uh, yeah. I'm going to do a little thing called Run for the Capital. Basically, uh, what it entails is dropping off 20 because they don't have any fucking troops especially not now they're fighting the goddamn dutch um uh, and they have like three dudes down here this is not they've got the mansion though so that's not gonna be pushed um down here they're gonna get pushed how to the river but up here they have no troops now run for the capital doesn't need a uh a supply line it simply needs your troops to fucking book it to berlin and just kind of grab all the supply points and, and just capitulate them that way. And even if it doesn't capitulate them, it breaks the fuck out of their uh, their dudes. Their dudes panic and they run everywhere, try to capture you, and then you weaken the front lines and you can push in. Operation Run for the Capital got stopped. They have so many divisions now. For fuck's sake, Putin, you stupid... I mean, Stalin, sorry. Same difference. You fucking idiot. For fuck's sake. Well, we've got Kiev. We've got a port. We do anything with that port? No, but we've got one. Oh, well, they finally did Anschluss. They finally got Anschlussed. It only took a, a year or so. Oh, probably two or three years extra. Prague is meant to be next, but I don't know if they'll uh, if they'll get the old checks. Um, sadly, my attempt to kill them this early has failed. Uh. There isn't a huge amount I can do left on this focus tree. Why can't I? Ah, more than 12%. I got no support. I got two point, almost, almost 2 million manpower though. We've killed like 2 million Germans. So now it's just kind of sit here and turtle up. Oh, the Belgians joined World War II. Uh, I think we could actually fight the Germans now. I think we can... Bye. We're taking back the Maginot one, one step at a time. Uh, if I... Attention. Hmm... Just get as many of these boys as possible, really fuck them up with the, with the sprinting. Oh, they declared war on the Czechs as well! I mean, the Czechs are gonna, eat, are gonna get eaten in the ass by the Hungarians, so that really fucks the Germans up, like, a lot. They are not having a good time. 
at all. Well, my second uh, invasion attempt's going much better. We've got marines now, at least. So now my shit's actually working. We're actually getting a decent way in. Hey, help. Fucking help. You're not going to live long if you don't get that port. So help them take the fucking port. We're absolutely kicking. These marines are kicking ass, honestly. Some great fucking marines you've got here. Oh shit, I can have like an infantry specialist now. Nice. And uh, this guy as well, because these guys are special forces. Oh fuck it, look, these dudes aren't getting pushed out at all. Maximum planning, fuck it. Look at these boys. Holding their fucking own. How are the front's going? Not so well. Oh my fuck! How do we. I guess they must have limited their, their dudes, because they, you know, they figured 10 plus forts, why not? Where the f- what the f- Well, I mean, I'm not complaining. Fuck it. Go on, boys. Great. How many divisions do they have? Not that many, really. Considering the amount of people they're at fucking war with. These guys are at war with a lot of dudes on a lot of fronts. And they are, they've only got like one on each front, so yeah, I don't know where their troops are, but they... Oh, actually, I, I do know where their troops are. Oh, they're not even over here, really. Huh. I don't know where the Germans are at. Are they down here? Oh, yeah, it's Hungarians down there. I have not got a fucking clue where the Germans are fighting, but they're not on any of the other fronts. I don't know where their troops are at. they got 84 dudes somewhere. Not a clue where. We're so close to fucking Belgium. We're gonna take Belgium as f oh my god! French troops have walked into fucking Belgium. Imagine, imagine the fucking scenes if French troops walked into Belgium. Oh my days! The Italians are next. They won't be. They're not too long for this world. You lads gotta be careful. They're gonna if they overwhelm us with. Do you know what? Get on that border instead and uh, take the north because then that guarantees us a port. Go lads, get that port. Ah, oh, good, we linked that. We linked them up. Beautiful. Kill them, boys. Holy shit. Luck <laughs> big Luxembourg, guys. That's some big Luxembourg. <laughs> I mean, that's about as big as it will ever get. Czechoslovakia, though. look at them. They've made a weird kind of hook hand looking thing, but they've not lost Prague. How many divisions are you rocking with? We don't know, but they are they haven't lost Prague though, so fucking hats off to them. Come on boys, march for Vienna. There's my trucks, there's my trucks. Truck into Vienna. Get on that fucking bridge. Germany's capitulated. They're gone. The Germans are gone. Now, no, not fucking Yugoslavia. Now's our time to push in and take out the only other Axis major. Go, boys. Go. Take out the only other major power. Well, it's safe to say the Italians aren't doing too well. They're uh, they're getting their shit kicked in as well. Up here doesn't really matter. The Marines are kind of handling it. Um. I'm not too pressed though, because once the Italians are gone, that's it. It's done. So uh, we've separated a big chunk of the Italian main force over here. And uh, now these boys are just pushing... Them. There's nobody guarding Rome. Are you kidding me? How is nobody guarding Rome? Now Italy's declared war on Italy. Oh, it's going to shit for you, Italy, isn't it? It's really going up the, up the shit. Alright, get... Where's the Italian... Oh, it doesn't even matter. Just go over here and push in down by the south. Take them out, boys. Charles Leclerc, come over here and just finish off the rest of them. Gee, I just have a fucking huge... I was just chilling. It's fucking late. I'm just chilling. I'm playing Hoi 4 and I just had the fucking largest spider of my fucking... Adult life crawled across my arm. I'm just chilling. I'm just trying to fucking play communist France. Why? Why me? <laughs> I'm just trying to play. I'm just chilling. Uh, this spider is not a fan of the communism. 
it just fucking the only it's dark as shit as well. The only thing that I saw was the light from my laptop illuminate it. I, I I don't know where it's gone. I've just hit it. It's down the side of my bed somewhere. Not a clue. But it's fucking terrifying. <laughs> oh god, it's trying to you can't stop it. Maybe the spider was Polish. You can't stop it, god damn it. We'll take Warsaw. Even with your real life distractions. Capitulate! Damn it. <laughs> I thought it'd be like like regular e uh Hoy 4 where they just capitulate the second fucking Warsaw disappears. Like, go. Why do they insist, oh by the way, on taking the like the path? It's so loud, hang on. Why do they insist on taking like the path of most violence? This is a weird looking French commune, by the way. Of taking the path of most violence. Like they insist on fucking fighting everyone. Just walk to Krakow, take it. That should be Poland basically gone from this entire war. Take Krakow. Italy is a major, but they got fucking they got African colonies that I'm not even gonna touch. Of course there's Italian troops. Oh, you lot, come take Breslau. Kick those fucking Italians out of Krakow. Come on. Italy is capitulated. Sick. Italy's gone. It's just Poland and Romania, I think, now. I don't know, it's just Poland. Who should go? Who the, how the fuck? How do you still have capitals? Do you capit when I'm playing fucking uh, Poland, they capitulate two seconds into me being in the fucking war with Germany. Fight against them? No, they got 80 fucking- and of course the Germans are backing them up. Fuck's sake. It's over! The war is over. I think actually I can get a- uh, if I- where is the- Alright, so if we go- If I change the government here, I can then add. Fuck off, England, you stupid cunt. Fuck off. Hey, this time it will stick. There we go. I get an achievement for demilitarizing the Rhineland. Jesus fucking Christ, that's disgusting looking. Oh god, it's gross. So, who's in what alliance? Ah, the common turn is very big. <laughs> uh, I could go to war with the Allies, but that would mean. Fuck, how many major powers do they have? I'd have to fight the UK, Australia, Mal Malaya counts as a fucking major power. Mexico, the US, fucking Ethiopia. Yeah, I can't be asked for that. Uh, Alright, thank you very much for watching. Um, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Uh,